Welcome back to another episode of Baxter's Buzz. I am your host, Baxter E. Hall. Welcome to my brain. Welcome to my frequency. Enter at your own risk. Uh, thank you for all the support, all the engagement. Please continue to uh, support and share. And um, today I want to get right into it. I want to talk about um, Martin Luther King Jr. Happy MLK Day. Uh, Martin Luther King Jr represented um, much more than uh, what many of us know from him. Um, he was an incredible activist who really embodied um, a strength that most of us just can't even fathom, right? Not a perfect person, um, clearly flawed like all of us, but galvanized so many help us, um, you know, recognize what was possible and what truly the American dream was. And it wasn't just for one section of people. But if this if this is America, this this is a dream for of, of us all. And uh, many times we get sort of a watered down version of him. Um, we don't think about how hard he fought, how tough he was, how he not only led troops, or excuse me, not led troops, but led um, activists and protesters, but he also was involved politically. There are so many different ways to sort of go about achieving your goals. Um, and sometimes we think there's just sort of just one way to go about things, but you have to um, be creative, work together. He had an awesome, uh, team that that was around him that sort of attacked it from different standpoints and i think that we all can learn about um you know going after justice understanding that we still have a long way to go but we've come a long way and a lot of that is because of the work that um mlk did and paving the way and, and giving us ideas that maybe we didn't have before as a people um, when i think about my ancestors specifically I'm very proud. Um, I, I feel very, very encouraged and empowered when I think about the lineage that I have come from. And, you know, my oldest is eight. Um, my journey, as far as learning more about my family, started a little bit before she got here. And it's this ongoing thing. This picture right here is a picture of my mom um, that I just got just a couple of uh, years ago um, because she passed away when i was so young I, there's not a lot of photos or even you know stories that I, I really have of her when you start to learn about your family you start to learn about the strength and the power and the adversity that people have faced it um reaffirms that you're here for a reason it reaffirms that we are here to inspire others we are here to help lift up others and to not step on on people but to lift them up and to inspire them and i um really I, I i know that i'm making my mom proud and i know that there's a lot of work to be done um people talk about their ancestors a lot in the black community and i think about some of the things that my ancestors specifically have been a part of you know of course slavery um like most black americans um as i've done more research i realized that um, my folks were also involved in the trail of tears another super low point in american history and I, I just you know find myself uh i know that how blessed i am to be here to be here and um these times specifically and 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 in a position to really try to make a difference and um it's not necessarily leading uh crowds or you know like mlk it, it it's um you know it's being an example for the, the folks around me, for my children, for my family, for my friends. But it's also, uh, you know, providing a platform for others to speak, and also, um, you know, speaking on things um, that I feel, you know, strongly about, and bringing awareness to things that maybe folks haven't always uh, looked at or understood that if this is, if there's unjust injustice happening one in one area, it's also impacting you. Um, even if it's not, if you, even if you can't see it yet, there's something that um, we must all work towards 
to resolve. Um, just, you know, uh, I just ask on this day, uh, whether you see it on MLK there or you see it another day, you know, uh, think about uh, your journey. Think about your purpose here and think about, um, you know, what doors you can open, who you can lift up, how, how you can uh, help provide education, help provide resources to people that may not have had the opportunities that you've had. And one of the things that MLK talked about was, you know, this sort of one America, right, for, for us all. And there shouldn't be, um, you know, these huge winners and any huge losers. I don't, I don't want to win um, because other people are losing. I think that there's enough to go around. It's just a matter about um, if it's important to you and how you are going to help your brothers. And, and, and we're all brothers and sisters in this in this thing at the end of the day. So um, as you think about um, this day, whether you have the day off or not, think about the American dream and um, your pursuit of it. Think about others that you can help along the way and doors that you can open so that other folks can experience some of those things that you you have, you have experienced or that you hope to experience yourself in the future. So again, thank you all for, for checking me out. Uh, happy birthday, Martin Luther King Jr. And um, until next time, peace.